What is going on everybody? We are back in San Diego Bay on the paddleboard. And uh, this is my first day back on the water here. So we're gonna go just do some generic stuff. I got the Ned rig rigged up and I got the drop shot and we're gonna go look for spotted bay bass, maybe some halibut. It's freaking cold and the water's cold. So uh, let's just see if we can get on any fish. All right, there's an outgoing tide. So I'm gonna fish uh, this real quick. I'm actually casting the drop shot rig. Oh, tag that bird. Uh, drop shot rig is actually for halibut. I like fishing this for halibut, but we're gonna fish it right by this real quick, see if there's anything on the outside. I'll work it pretty quick. See if there's any bait getting pulled out of this little marina. Oh, get the drop off there. I haven't fished a 10 pound leader in like months. It feels like I'm fishing with like hair. My braid is still the same, but my leader line is tiny. Got fit on the first cast, but nothing stuck. We're just gonna pop this thing. Just kind of pop it up out of the grass and let it come down. And we'll get farther out and look for halibut. Cool to find Corvina in this, but I don't think they are. Swip along this sand edge. Don't be deep. Let's see who's here. Come on, halibut. Where are you? Where art thou? I haven't even seen one. Normally I could like spook one or see one or see one fall on my bait. Nothing. Have they just not moved into the bay yet? That doesn't seem right. Alright, there's the channel we want right there. It's like two grass, sand channel right down the center. Well, there's still no bait like anywhere. Not sure where the bait fish are at. But they're not in the back bay right now. This should look like a little tasty morsel coming down the channel on a good outgoing tide. Like, I haven't seen a single spotty hanging out in here. I haven't seen anything else spooking out. I don't see bait moving. Like, there is current coming through this. Uh, yeah, no idea what's going on here. No freaking idea. Oh shit, we got a freaking halibut on right now. Oh my god, I thought I was stuck in the freaking grass. I didn't even realize it. Oh, it's a decent fish. <laughs> I am a moron, guys. Straight moron. Straight moron. What in the heck? Oh my god. It's a decent fish, too. That's potentially legal. I wasn't even, like, paying attention. Sitting here complaining about how there's no fish. Oh, he's probably got my bait into his mouth. I can't quite see it. No, it's sticking out. We're good. Whew. I, like, realized I got bit. I didn't even realize. Just, like, pulled up because I was in the grass. Nice. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. All right. We got a little scale here. So let's see how long it goes. It goes in increments of five. So we've got... Uh, 5, 10, 15, 20 back here. So he ticks. Let's go up to the nose. 20 inch mark is right there. So he's probably 21 inches, maybe 22. Look at that. The hook just fell out. Let's see if we can snap a photo and get going. Let's see if we can get the angry. <laughs> Look at freaking that. Oh, he's trying to munch me so hard. Alright guys, check it. Oh. 
All right, guys, here's what we just caught that fish on. That's the drop shot rig right there. I'm just doing a little six or eight inch leader to a four inch fluke right there. This is like a perch color. And to be honest, this setup has got me my biggest rod and reel halibut in San Diego. That was my biggest fish. I've gotten one that's like in the mid 30 range on this exact same setup and it just works great. I use like this perch-ish color or like new penny. I don't know, I just like it, uh, but I'm sure they don't really care whether you use smelt or white, gold, green, whatever. You what works for you, but the halib or the, uh, the drop shot rig just works so good for halibut. And I think the reason why is halibut, when they sit flat, they need to eat a bait going up. And so you're fishing the bottom, they don't have that like jump forward lunge action. So they want this bait to be up a couple inches above them when they get to it. Uh, and so the drop shot just works phenomenally, phenomenally good. Um, 10 pound braid, 10 pound top shot, little like, I think this is like a one knot hook, size one knot or one, and that four inch bait right there. Let's go see if we can get some more. All right, we're on the channel edge. Let's see if we can just catch a freaking spotted. Like, I have not caught one yet, and it's kind of ridiculous. Like, they're not, they're not supposed to be the hard ones to catch. Oh, that's one. There we go, finally. Hundred percent head shaking spotty. And that's actually a freaking like little tanker. All right guys, check it out, freaking 12 or 13 inch spotty in the back bay, San Diego Bay. Freaking epic. How did today just like turn around? We just, it was so slow. I was like, man, where the heck are these fish at? And then freaking bam, halibut, bam, big spotty. Whew. Just tossed that spotty back in. I'm gonna fix this uh, drop shot setup here so it looks correct. It's actually sitting inside of there. Uh, same bait. <laughs> I haven't even retied today, so let's just keep that going. Seems like the way to go. We're sitting on the channel edge now. I'm in probably seven feet of water, eight feet of water. And uh, we're fishing right on the outsides of the grass, right where the grass drops. We've got like one sand patch here, grass comes out and drops down. So got all that water coming out of the bay this way. We've got the river mouth over here. We've got all the water from back there and it's all funneling right through here. So there should be fish all the way through this, just waiting for bait to come by. That was freaking. That was a bite, and I missed. There we go. <laughs> missed him. <laughs> I don't know how to be working the bait. It's just drifting by itself. The current's pulling so hard that it's that it's pulling uh, it's pulling the bait by itself. And that's a big ass shovel nose shark right there. Guitar fish, actually. Sorry. <laughs> Wow, that fish took off. Is this another freaking tanker spotty? Yeah, another decent spotty. How is this? We are not fishing back bay right now. All right, chunky little south bay spotty right there. Nice little, I don't know, he's probably 10, 12 inches. Woo. All right, guys, we are back in the car. Uh, it was, it got windy outside and there's a bunch of people and I don't know, it was just a pain in the butt outside. So. Uh, pretty good day of fishing. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you back out on the water next time.